Hello everybody, welcome to a brand new Let's Play series in Hearts of Iron 4, again in the Old World Blues mod. So today we're going to be playing as Caesar's Legion. Uh, one thing I did notice when I booted up the mod is that apparently they added all of Mexico in there, and I don't know when they did that. So at some point I'm sure we will look into uh, doing a campaign down here in Mexico, but I have to kind of look and see, you know, how this all plays out uh, through this campaign, and then you know, focus on who do you want to play as next time. So... Uh, we started a war with uh, the Twisted Hairs over here. We have a decent uh, army already on their border, so we can just kind of, I'm assuming, deal with that pretty, pretty easily. Like, how many men do you have? Uh, 11, 18 divisions. We have 14 right here. We can put a handful more on your front, draw a line all the way up towards Hoover Dam, and also turn off the Fog of War, because I think it looks terrible. So, um... First things first, research lots. Uh, reward. Oh, they changed this. Technology only access to focuses and other nine uh, researchable actions. Okay, so we can't really do anything here to research. That's fine. So apparently we're civilized. We're not advanced, unfortunately. We're also not a super mutant civilization. So research speed plus two percent, I think, is good. Um, max factories. Construction speed, I think, will be good for now. Let's just get all these basic researches going. Most of them are done anyway, very fast. Like, three months is not a long, long time for this at all. Uh, we got some more civilian factories. Well, we're going to be attacking into the NCR. How many factions does the NCR have right now? They have about... About, actually, the same amount as we do. I'm assuming we just have a lot of military factories. Yeah, we have 30. So, I'm going to build a handful of... um. Civilian workshop, just to kind of in our capital over here. And that, I mean, that's not our capital, but that's fine. We're just, you know, somewhere deep within our territory. So we get all these guys, including you, actually, deploy off to this front. Add in some leaders. Apparently, we only have two, which is not a lot, I will say. Uh, so we get some basic melee weapons. We don't have any firearms, do we? We do have some pipe guns. So we'll get, like, three of them into there. We'll get some scout kits, because I'm sure those are going to be useful at some point. Uh, scrap motorcycles for some mechanized divisions, get some support equipment, and then, I mean, also get some dynamite, because I'm sure some of our troops need it. And I think that's more or less okay. Let's see if we get some more of these going. We don't have any aircrafts, you know, armored vehicles, so that's okay. Uh, we have apparently 220 convoys, which is actually, like, a ton. So let's go for a trireme, I guess. Build five triremes here, and then we're going to build up some some long boats. Yes, I mean, that sounds good, right? So we need some more resources. Let's get scrap metal from... Basically, nobody likes us. So it's trading with people is going to be difficult. So let's... Uh, New Vegas. We'll not be able to construct any... How many factories do I have? We need 50% of our factories for this. Rejection of ammunition. Civilian economy. Okay, so basically our industry is a little bit trash right now. And that sucks. We'll also uh, do this right away. It's only like seven days, which is not bad. Uh, we also got some more troops over here. Is that everybody? Yes. So who do we attack first from this list? I mean, there's a lot of... There's a lot of invasions we do. The Hang Dog, Swin Mothers, Tucson, or the County Cowboys. Well, I think Tucson has 17 divisions. No, we'll go for the Cowboys next. So they are basically, should hopefully just be a walk in the park. So we'll put our troops over here for now. Nobody said basic training. Well, basic tribal militias, I'm sure you're probably garbage. We're not even going to train you up. Let's at least get you up to, um, Demolition, Soft Hack. The organization goes down if we do this. But Breakthrough goes up a decent amount. Heart Attack goes by about 10. I mean, that seems pretty good to me. Or at least it goes down, though, by 10 points. That might be because we have the demolitions here. Yeah, but it's most... I mean, this looks fine. So we'll just save this up for now. 
and we'll eventually we'll retrain all our troops up to uh, that version. So, um, we're at war. I know that. No template right now for scrap motorcycles. Well, let's design a division. Um, do I want to duplicate? Yes. Remove everything. Just like remove the whole tree. And we'll just uh, remove everything. And then we're going to build uh, probably just like a small motorized division to be honest. I don't think we need anything too crazy. Just like a, you know, that might be good. Add some infantry divisions in there as well. Your soft attack goes down a lot. Your hard attack goes down a decent amount as well. You have more HP than normal. Suppression's gone up. But the, the whole point is actually, I just want you to be able to move fast. And you basically, yeah, you're doubling speed. You're going to be a lot weaker, but you're basically doubling how fast you are, so... I don't think we need chems in there. Yeah, we'll keep you in charge. So that's fine. So we'll keep you here. Uh, we'll train up two of you, and then we'll train up a handful of legionaries. I think that seems pretty okay. We still basically have, like, no resources right now, so we really need to conquer some stuff. No question about that. Also, they changed the animation, so you're no longer all holding guns. I mean, that's kind of nice. Um, this is a miscellaneous tab. Encore states. We have no Encore states. Okay. So apparently, I don't know when they updated this mod, actually. I don't really follow the development of it, so... Are you guys, you guys are not ready. I'm assuming people are not in position. That's fair. I mean, you guys shouldn't be, like, that difficult to deal with. The Great Collins wants a non-aggression pact. Sure, I mean, we want to, like, expand our faction as much as humanly possible, I think. Let's actually just go straight to speed, speed 5. So the expedition to Blackfoot. The expedition to Blackfoot tribe was a uh, defining event in Legion history. The tribe is the foundation of Caesar's Great Legion. And it threw the flames of primitive tribes, wars that will that the Iron Will Caesar was forged. Weapons maintenance, uh, reliability goes up, organization goes up, or production cost goes down. For, for that only for demolition though. Definitely I think we just want plus 10% organization. I think that just sounds good. Death in the canyons. Apparently nobody feels actually confident with attacking. And I'm assuming that's because we had everybody uh Upgrade when we are at war probably was not the smartest idea. So death in the canyons the earliest years of the legion uh, were also some of the most brutal uh, In his conquest of the canyons Caesar really slaughtered three of the local tribes each act just as cruel But one act came particularly infamy in the waste Stability and war support goes up recovery rate goes up or division training time goes down. Well, I think this one's kind of bad Like I don't think like plus five percent stability right now We're at war that's gonna go up, you know anyways later so I think just a recovery rate. And we're going to go for the legit. Yeah, I guess you guys are like basically half strength. Which kind of sucks, but what can you do? I mean, the answer is not upgrade all your troops right away. That That's one thing we could have done. So. I think we do just like attack into you. And just try to break some, like, weaker points. Okay, so Joshua Graham, the Malpius Legit, was the co-founder of the Legion and Caesar's greatest servant. A shrewd, cunning general, this early act cemented his legend across the Legion and formed the base of his military prowess. He burned Phoenix to the ground, spawns three locked and placed the divisions with one explosive company, Three Fatality Divisions with the uh, Recon Company, or two Motorized Divisions. I think I'm going to go for the Siege Divisions, just because that sounds cooler, and I have no idea what they actually do. The other two are guys that we can just train up ourselves. So what are you? What are you? Oh, you're kind of actually just trash. So never mind. So then, so Caesar, Son of Mars. So Caesar's will is law, he is a god among men, son of the god of war Mars. All in his legion live to serve him, as a blade serves his master. 
He is the teacher and master of the tribes under him, and in his conquest taught many lessons. Chief among them which, death to the profligates, partisans go down, organization lost when moving, or... Military leader cost goes down. This is, this is, I think this one's the only one that's actually kind of okay. The other ones just seem more or less bad. I would say at least. So why are you so strong? Entrenchment terrain, country, commander skill. I mean, it's nighttime, sure. But most of our attacks aren't really actually going anywhere. Did he just call me a, a degenerate? Extremely rude. Okay, so let's go for political power. We're just going to attack um, a bunch of other people right away. Even while we're dealing with this, it's fine. So we can modify our government. We have 158 political power. What do we want to do with that? Can we go straight to war economy? No, because world tension is not high enough. And uh, this guy's too weak for us to really do it. So, the fox cutting, encryption, decryption, and daily people support. I mean, that's good, except for the daily people support. We don't want them in charge. Economy lock, conscription lock, cost goes down. Intellectual support. So, these basically give us more support for things that we don't actually want. That's research speed. I think we basically just want to get infantry weapons down. But you actually you don't give a bonus, you're just making them cheaper. 15% attack is pretty nice. Organization goes up by 10.5%. Breakthrough plus 25% chance is also like really nice. I think we're just going to go for... Oh well, no, we can't even do this yet, so we're going to go for just 15% attack. And hopefully that benefits us uh, decently enough. Okay, so I want you to push here. So we're 85-86 on this battle, so we should at least break our way through here. Which will be nice. Uh, so what do we want to do? I apparently have been... I guess on speed 5, these finish like super fast. So we're going to go for the ca uh, the cowboy county first. Yeah, so you go up this way. Actually, only one of you needs to go this way, right? Like, can you... No, this is actually only one place. Okay. Okay, so you go up. You fight here. Um, one of you d does need to stay behind, unfortunately. So we'll just keep on pushing up this way. Very, very close to their major, major cities. We can't deal with this situation because we don't have factories, unfortunately, at the moment. Does region clear war on the Vipers? Okay. Not a huge deal for us, I would say. You're gonna go to here. And I think that works out fine. Okay, 72. You're gonna win this battle. And I think they fell back, I think, to try to defend their major cities. Which is understandable, but still. Anybody who's on this front... I mean, most of these guys are already doing what they need to be doing anyways. If we go here... We might be able to surround him off. Actually, let's go down to speed 4 for a second. Okay, so you've been overrun. Everybody who's on this front is here. You just go deal with that. Thank you. And you all... You're fighting this way. 
You're going this way. Um, I feel like I've already lost like way more men. Ah, eh, we've actually killed more. We've lost like actually like only two hundred soldiers, which is not that much. No. Okay, my key phone keeps telling me there's an update. Like, please stop. Like, I don't need to worry. It's schedule of the install. You know, what? two in the morning. That sounds great. So, we've taken the city. Actually, if we go here, we might be able to get a surround on this guy. Giving us a little bit more of an advantage. Actually, yeah, you go here and then move up and around to attack like this. You're going to go straight to here and then move through dry wells to the back. I think that makes sense. The cowboy can't, can't stop us. Like, um... About 19 days, so we can actually finish them off. Yeah, so I think that works out okay. You go to Kingman, and then try to push your way up. Yeah, something like that should work, I think. I mean, these guys might be able to break the way to drywall first anyways. I mean, they did take back this city. Which is a shame. And all these guys should have low supplies. They do. Negative 33%. We're going to check drywalls in a moment. They're... I was going to say they're close capitulation. That's not really true at all. But we always at least uh, surround a handful of people. So you're at 60... Drywall's fallen. Dry wells, I guess I should say. So, you guys are pushing up your way this way. You push your way over here. You are going to fall back here just to get this around. You know, please. I understand that you're being attacked right now. And that could be an issue for many people, but please, uh... Yeah, you go here first. I mean, how close are they? We took your capital, they're at 41%. Yeah, you try to fight these two guys. I mean, these guys are surrounded, like, they should... ...die given enough time. I mean, that's... I mean, this is a way that makes sense, right? Like, they should eventually just kick the bucket. So, go over here. We'll try to just surround these troops off. You know, like, and cut them off from supplies if at all possible. And apparently, I have some more free military factories. Beautiful. Uh, let's get some more uh, scout tribal kits because I'm sure that's important for something. Uh, more free dockyards. Throw them into these boats. That's okay. We're basically not even building these because we don't have... Enough supplies at all to get it done. You go like this. You fall back here. Well, not falling back. But you're just gonna attack in that general direction. And this, these guys should meet their ends soon enough. You go back and around to the city. This guy's pretty weak right now. And we do have our cost is barely against the Cowboys. But I think this is going to be a good time to end this first episode off. So thank you for watching. My name is Anthem. If you've enjoyed, my thumbs up. If you're not, you can always thumbs down. Watch me subscribe. And goodbye.